comes in a very, very unexpected place. Primo Levi, in his book, If This Is a Man, recounts his imprisonment in Auschwitz, a place that you would clearly not believe is a place where things are going well. Uh, so why would you care about aesthetics in a place like that? Well, one afternoon he talks about uh, how he and a fellow prisoner had to uh, walk to the other side of the concentration camp to get the, the daily food for their, for their group. So of course, they took the most circuitous route possible, obviously. Why would you not do that if you were in that situation? And as they're walking, Primo Levi begins to recite Dante. And it becomes immediately apparent that his fellow prisoner had never read it. And he's all the more excited to share the wondrous words of Dante with, his, with, this, uh, other, with this other man. And as he's reciting, he gets stuck. He can't remember this one connecting line. And so he starts over again, thinking that maybe if he does it again, that'll jog his memory. He can't remember it. And he makes, he makes a bold uh, proclamation. He says, I would have given up my daily food just to be able to remember. And that seems so strange. Like you're already, like, this is not like someone that is saying, well, I'd skip breakfast, but then I just have a really big lunch. You know, <laughs> this is someone that skipping this is that's it for the day. It's barely anything anyway. Uh, and it's for the entire day. Well, you may wonder well, why. Well, he gives us the answer right 